Okay, we got the wiring harness separated from the um, from the 81 for the electronic ignition. So that goes to the um, to the engine to the to the little connector coming out of the uh, the engine. This goes to the igniter. This goes to the ground. Pretty sure. Um, there's a red wire coming out of the igniter. Um, it kind of all met up, I believe, with the kill switch. So, one second. We have the two coils here. One red wire, red and white wire also came out of the orange one, the one that has the orange, and the one that, what is it, uh, the one that has the gray has another red and white one. And that seems to be the main one that goes to this kill switch. I believe they're all spliced in here, so I'd take the one out of this coil. I'm going to sp splice it back into there. And take the one coming out of the igniter, splice it back into there. There was, uh, there was an extra wire. I believe that is for the safety relay. I don't think I need to splice that one in. That one went to the uh, back of the bike on the 81, and I think I don't need to. I don't need to put that anywhere on my bike. Uh, now, I think in the end there's going to be basically what is it? The igniter and the other coil spliced into the to the the red and white one coming out of the other coil, and then you have black black wire for the ground. So let's look at the current harness. So I think the only thing left over for the for the um, contacts were this. So that's a red and white wire, and I believe this goes to the kill switch. Um, it kind of splices in here, and a red wire goes to the back. Now I'm thinking maybe since the other wire had a red wire going to the back, should I splice? Should I splice this into that little area where they all meet? Or is this something that's useless? Um, so I'm not really sure about that. Black wire, I may just connect it with one of these black wires that kind of comes and I believe meets up with the, this ground. Um, or maybe I'll just take a wire by itself and attach it also here. Um, so that's pretty much it. I guess my main question is, I guess after the kill switch, um, pretend I remove it from right there and right here, should this be spliced into that little area as well? Who knows, maybe this has like a safety relay, but I didn't see it in the diagrams or in the wiring diagram. Okay, that's pretty much it, and I'll talk to you later.